Well guys, it's finally here. I said I was gonna make another video on this topic in my comment section. By the way guys, thank you guys so much for your support on my Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Battle Pass video. That is absolutely insane. That's the best video on my channel. First video to hit 100 plus likes. And I really wanna thank you guys because it really means a lot to me. Plus the amount of subscribers I gained from that video. It's just, it's overwhelming. I truly do appreciate it. I hope I can keep making great content for you guys. If you guys have any other questions dealing with Black Ops 4, I'll try the best of my ability to answer it in a video just for you guys. As we, as Xbox players, we get everything a little bit late, but October 26th, I said 10 a.m. most likely because that's usually when Call of Duty releases stuff. I'm gonna assume maybe Fridays might be their day because I know in Call of War 2, it was like Tuesdays, we got an update. This is the first time I've ever seen a Friday update besides like double XP. We didn't really need a, a huge update. It was just a hot patch. So I'm gonna assume it did it overnight in my Xbox or something because it's already here. But you guys can tell I'm already have it hovered over the black market when you click on it yes there is a free part for those who bought the game you get the operation first strike free now if you're like me and trying to figure out where's the halloween event that is because you need the battle pass i'm pretty sure you need the battle pass in order to get it so if you had the battle pass sweet you got the halloween event unfortunately i do not have the battle pass yet i'll get it sometime in the future but until then, at least we got some free tiers to grind out. By the way, there is an, a total of 200 tiers, which is absolutely insane. So first we have a tag, which is very, very interesting. I actually don't know what the tags are for. You got some stickers, a calling card, another tag, selfie, what? Oh my God, they really, all right, okay. I believe uh, reserves contain uh, variants and all that. So you'll get some type of variant that has reactive camo and the mastery camo. If you guys want a video on that, I'll have one out shortly based on how to get that. Another sticker, tranquility. What do you do? Do you really just sit on the ground? Intriguing. Another reserve. Ooh, that is actually a pretty nice outfit, not gonna lie. We have another tag. Actually, that's kind of cool. It's the Grim Reaper with wings, DJ, DJ Reaper. There we go. Boom, this one actually has a lot of reserves on towards this end. Another sticker, a harm burger. Okay. Make it rain. Oh my, this is honestly my favorite gesture. I have it in Fortnite and now they have it in here. This is, oh my God, I'm gonna love it. Another reserve, another tag, no, a lot of reserves. That's a funny sticker, not gonna lie. You know, I just realized those tags could be like the spray paint. You got more reserves, another lit camo, all right. And the serif got a lot of a lot of cool stuff. Another reserve. A sticker. A calling card. More reserves. There's quite an amount of reserves. Look like. Alright. Okay, ruin. I got you. Laugh attack. We need to bust out laughing. Oh my god. Imagine getting like a quad feed and just busting that emote out. anything else though there's a lot of reserves oh berserker no, that's an okay one not the greatest i can mess with it got ajax as a cartoon character a lot of reserves oh here we go sandstorm the weapon variants in black Ops 4 are called signature weapons so here's one of them the sandstorm it's for the titan the titans are really really good lmg i'm not gonna lie more reserves way more reserves ghost hunter you know this kind of has like the ghostbuster theme with the green on them that's, that's pretty dope i like it for nomad all right for ajax we got this style for him it's it's decent not the greatest in my opinion i mean it's pretty cool to use more reserves <laughs> look at little cartoon crash it's kind of dope we got this eight. Oh, this one's actually pretty dope. Has like blood on them, making markings. Okay, that that's pretty dope. Pretty dope. <laughs> oh my god, these little like the cartoon versions of the characters are so funny. Look at battery. What's this one? Hoop. There it is. Okay. See this one? Oh my god, he's hula hooping. Oh, a little killer cat. Even though it should be a dog, because the dog's really annoying in this game. Got battery. Pretty dope. Mad respect. Yeah, okay, I can mess with that. We got this outfit battery. It's a decent one. 
Oh, another signature weapon for the GKS. This, like I said, this SMG is a really good one. Honestly, one of the best SMGs in the game, in my opinion. <laughs> Look at the torque. Look at him. He's just, it's so adorable. You see these little car uh, cartoon character versions of him. I can, like, imagine, like, a Call of Duty Black Ops 4 cartoon series for kids or something. It'd be pretty funny. All right, we got torque with his. Kind of, kind of menacing. Imagine someone just camping out and he just looks you in the face with that face, just like, yeah, I just did that to you. A lot of reserves. I'm not gonna lie. A fire break, a little cartoon version of him. There we. Oh my god, this actually might be my favorite. Look at that. I really want this fire break camo because it looks pretty freaking dope. I love purple, but this is purple with a light blue, which is honestly my favorite combinations. Got a little. Unicorn calling card. That's pretty dope. There's Prophet's little cartoon character. You got this Torque outfit. Eh, I guess. So if you look carefully on his back, he has a sledgehammer. Is that a possible future DLC melee weapon? If I am the first one to say this, I'm taking all credit. All right, that's gonna be a future DLC weapon. Don't don't hold that at me accountable though. But if it is, if it does come true one day, you heard it from me first. Okay. All right. Dude, I honestly like the blue color outfits. They're pretty, they're nice. Honestly, I gotta admit, they're really nice. <laughs> the recon tag. Oh my God. That, it's just, I don't know what, like what's about it. It's just, it's cartoony. It's kind of kiddish. It's just kind of cool. And plus on a business end, if you're trying to cater to kids, you're nailing it. There we go. We got some crash outfits. This one's not my favorite. I'm going to be in all honesty. It's just, I don't know. It just looks weird. Is that a cat on a T-Rex? Oh my God. That's so funny. All right. We got this recon outfit. Ah, I'm going to give that a one out of 10. I don't know. It throws me off. We got this recon outfit. I mean, it's, it's kind of cool. Here is the last page where you get a blackout character, Hudson, which is really cool. And what everybody's been dying for, the blinding gory. And I really cannot wait to get this ICR variant because the iron sights are so dope on it. It's what I love about these variants. It's like they change something about it to give it like the weapon like not like a reskin but it's like they change something about it to make it more unique and more of a like yeah it's a variant i'd rather have that variant over the the base variant but yeah guys that is all 200 tiers for operation first strike sadly i do not have the halloween event so if you do comment down below what are the best tiers to get in the halloween event side of the black market other than that, I'm really happy that we finally got it. We have plenty of time to grind this up. We have 53 days, nearly two months to get all these tiers done. And I'm not quite sure how fast you can complete a tier. Hopefully it's like really quick. But when I find out, I'll make a video about it. But if you guys did enjoy, drop a like, subscribe if you are new, hit those post notifications, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. But, but once again, I just want to say thank you guys so much for your support. It truly does mean a lot to me. Yeah. Hey. Ultra, ultra, ultra. How do we get so rare? Ultra, ultra. ultra.